So to buy and sell a house at the same time is very complicated. Um, my advice to you is number one, to get your home for sale ready first. I would get in there, I would get packing mentally, get ready that you're gonna move and get your house on the market. And then you start to shop for your next home. The reason why you wanna do that first is because if you go ahead and find a house first that you like, you put in an offer on it, it's gonna be what they call contingent on the sale of your home. Now you're working backwards. You have to put your house on the market, you have to get an offer, and then you might lose the offer that's on the table with the other house. So you wanna make sure that you're able to go into this completely prepared. So number one, you need to put your house on the market. Number two, you find the house that you want to buy and you put an offer in on it. Then number three, you have to wait until your house gets an offer and then it triggers their house to go under contract. And then you both have to move forward simultaneously through inspections and you are gonna have to close on the same day. You are gonna have to sell your house first. Closing on the same day is the house that you're gonna sell. So you get the proceeds from your closing and then it goes directly towards the next purchase, which is later on in the day. Um, and, and then it goes to the purchase of your new house. Now this can get kind of hairy and I understand because you're probably gonna be sitting in the parking lot with a truck packed full of stuff. There's a lot of um, emotions that go along with it. It is stressful, but um, if you have a good agent with you, they're gonna coach you through it and try and buffer as much of the drama and um, stress as they can. But this is something that people do every day. It's just something that you don't wanna have to do every day. <laughs>